Thanks for those, Martin, and well done to Kevin Meenahan picking up the Close Brothers in the last. So it's the Neptune Investment Novices Hurdle up next. Race 8 on your cards. And it's over 2 mile 5 furlongs. It's a grade 1 hurdle. So Arlington Killer for Vinnie Gerrard. Barrel Blaster for Neil Van Rensburg. Daring Knight for Craig Beckwith. Fascination for Joshua Sutherland. Light of Joy for David Hooley. So Black So Trouble for Alex Cherry. Theory of Everything for Joshua Sutherland. Artisan Tiles for Darren Thompson. Bogside Balloon for David Ladd. Charm Point for Darren Thompson. Dominion and Duchess for Craig Allen. Keep Your Dreams for Leon Van Rensburg. Light of My Eyes for David Hooley. Ozark Bridal for Vinnie Gerrard. Velvet Curtain for Martin Leadham. Well, all the group ones have gone to the top three trainers so far. Let's see if we can get a change out in this one. It's Neptune Investment Novices Hurdle is well underway. Through the first furlong. It's Derry Knight for Craig Beckwith that's going to lead this. Velvet Curtain of Martin lead him over the first of the 11 flights. We'll take that well. So it's Derry Knight running out to uh, sort of centre course. Come over towards the fence shortly. Velvet Curtains in second as they start to tack over towards the rail. So Daring Knight from Velvet Curtain out wide still is Arlington Killer. Ozark Bridal towards us here, and both green silks of Vinnie Gerard. Between those is Fascination for Josh Sutherland. Up against the fence towards us is Charmed Point as they skip over the second. We'll take that well. So up. So beyond Charmed Point is uh, Arlington Killer, who's dropped back a little bit now, and uh, Keep Your Dreams for Leon Van Rensburg, the grey artisan tile is also for Darren Thompson. Wider still is David Hooley's Light of Joy, running alongside Barrel Blaster. And the second of the greys for Craig Allen, Dominion Duchess. And you've got Sablazzo Trouble for Alex Cherry. Second of the Hooley Horses, Light of My Eyes, David Robertson's Bogside Balloon. Just at the rear. As they get to the third, they'll get over that well. Daring Knight didn't take it over the best. And Velvet Curtain just jumped himself into the lead. So they're through the first four flights, and it's Velvet Curtain and Daring Knight. Lead them over it. Take it well. Mistake towards the rear by the light of my eyes. Still out wide. The one that hasn't got any room to go is Barrel Blaster for Neil Van Rensburg. has got himself uh, trapped behind a wall of horses. But it's Velvet Curtain and Daring Knight. Still leading by about three. Mozart Bridle up against the fence. In quite close order here as they come to the fifth. The leaders are over it. No one took that well. Barrel Blaster was a little bit slow. So we go past the grandstand and the finish post. Six flights to take. Just under a mile and a half to travel, so a daring night velvet cut still lead uphill. By about three or four from Ozark Bridal Chan Point and Artisan Tile is a little bit wider than the second of the Greys Dominion Duchess. Moving through up alongside the rail now is Bogside Balloon. Behind that is I think right of my eyes, David Hooley. Wider of those is the first of the Josh Sutherland horses, Fascination. Right through by his stable mate theory of everything. Keep your dreams and barrel blaster. Get to the six. We'll take it well, just at the rear is the black, so trouble for Alex Cherry. But Daring Knight leads us from Velvet Curtain in second. Three or four back to Ozark Bridal and Artisan Tarlis. We come along to the next. It's Daring Knight that noses back in front. From Velvet Curtain. And we're going to be pushed along again. Try and join Daring Knight as they get to the next, the seventh, which will be four from home. Both take it well, better jump by Velvet Curtain, jumps himself into the lead again. Towards the rear, Sir so Trouble just stepped over it. So Velvet Curtain and Daring Knight still. By about four to Arthur Zales and Ozak Bridal. And we've got Chand Point, Bogside Balloon. And out wide is Dominion Duchess. Wider still is Fascination. A few of these uh, being pushed along now, getting into better position, but it's this Daring Knight that leads us into the eighth. So that's three from home with just two to jump. So Daring Knight from Velvet Curtain. But coming out of the pack now is Fascination, moving well on the outside. Also being followed through by Chand Point. Here comes the first of the Van Rensburg horses. Keep your dreams, moves out wide. But this is Daring Knight that's got a length advantage now as Velvet Curtain starts to slow up a little bit. Chand Point moving into second now. So as we come into the final half mile, is this Daring Knight still leads by a couple. Charm 
on point trying to run him down out wide is keep your dreams fascination artisan talis it's going to be between these they go over the ninth with just two to jump it's daring knight from chan point fascination artisan talis keep your dreams velvet curtain ozark bridal still trying to run on his dominion duchess as well as bogside balloon but daring knight still leads but they're going to take him on the tenth and it's daring knight from chan point moving well on the outside is keep your dreams and it's chan point and keep your dreams that take this up now inside the final two and it's chan point from keep your dreams chan point starting to pull away his stable mate arton and talis moves into second dominion duchess on the wide outside is third but if this is chan point he's got a couple of lengths advantage inside the final furlong chan point from ozark bridal coming out of the pack from biddy gerard chan points over the last and it's chan point inside the last hundred yards it's chan point from ozark bridal bobside balloon trying to make up some ground to get out into third dominion the duchess was fourth so a great one event doesn't go to one of the top three trainers it goes to Darren Thompson well done picks up the Neptune invest uh, investment novices hurdle with Chand Point gets himself on the leaderboard well done second was Ozark Bridal for Vinnie Gerard. third was Bogside Balloon for David Robertson fourth was Dominion Duchess for Craig Allen and fifth was Light of Joy for David Hooley